Friday and it is after work. I actually was going to do overtime today and I started early so I could do overtime and get off earlier. But once it hit my eight hours, I was like, no. Nah. Um, I think I told you guys before that overtime is not mandatory. So it, it does get mandatory sometimes, but it hasn't been that way in a long time. So once I hit my eight hours, I was like, peace out, gotta go. So I just wanna enjoy my evening. Like I said, it's Friday and it's just Boston and I that are here right now. Shine is at work. Savannah is with a friend and Boston is sitting in front of her door. He's seen her go out the door because she left maybe around 12.30, but he's in front of her door because her door is closed. I don't know if he forgot. Y'all know how he is. So I am just going to sit here <laughs> and relax. I have my wind tunnel fan on, if you guys can hear that fan in the background. And yeah, it is so hot outside, you guys. So I went out to check the mail. My mailbox is not that far from my house, but I still have to walk kind of like down the street it is so hot out there. It's 106. I don't know if you guys can see that. Probably not. I don't know. Anyway, it's 106. Trust me. And it's hot. And oh my word. Tomorrow's supposed to be 109. I do have a wedding to go to. One of the members of the church is getting married. So Shine and I are actually going to that tomorrow. Savannah doesn't want to go. So y'all, let me relax. And... I'll talk to you guys again if there's anything vlog worthy. Okay, so I just finished watching Fear Street Part 2, 1978. It's a three-part series, and the last, no, the first one came out last Friday, and one today, and one comes out next Friday. I probably should have waited till all three was out. That way I can watch them all back to back, but it was okay. I needed something to watch, and it's not that scary, so that's why I was able to watch it here alone. But I also wanted to show you guys, I don't know if you've noticed, but in my last few vlogs, hopefully the quality has been better. But you guys, I got a MacBook Air and the cover I got for it is Sunflower, so I'm really liking it. Um, I use iMovie now to edit my videos and the cover also came with this little Sunflower key cover right here I don't know if I'm gonna keep this on here because I don't know I, I like the clicking of the keys and plus I'm not that great of a typist so I don't know and anyway it's just a picture of me and my kiddos good morning everyone y'all are right here so you guys already know so y'all it's supposed to be like so hot this weekend and oh did I say it's Saturday morning good morning it's Saturday so I actually went to bed pretty early last night. Savannah and Cheyenne both spent the night to their friend's house. So it was just me and the dog. And I fell asleep early and actually had a good night's sleep. Yeah, but it is seven o'clock right now. And the reason why I am out is because I think I told you guys yesterday, briefly, that I am going to a wedding today. And the wedding is at 5.30 but it's like on the other side of town and I know I need to get gas so you know the hottest time of the day is usually around four or five five o'clock and exactly when I'm going to be out I'm just gonna get gas this morning that way I won't have to do it later and while I'm out I am just going to get breakfast and some coffee and go back home so yeah you guys it's like I said it's seven o'clock it is already 80 degrees out here so yeah it's going to be hot today they said it can get up to 112 today Okay, so I made it back home. I did go to McDonald's. All I got was a sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle. And I got the meal. It came with a hash brown. And then for the drink, I just got coffee. I got hot coffee, even though I know it's hot outside, but I just wanted hot coffee. So, yeah. And when I left, I put Boston outside to go use the bathroom. I tried to bring him back in. He wasn't ready to come back in. 
So I left them out when I went to get gas and all that because I'm like, it's gonna be quick. It's not too hot right now. I feel real nasally. I know why, because last night I, and I know I'm jumping stories here, but last night I left the air on because it is going to be really hot today. So my house is well insulated and it takes a long time to cool down. So instead of, you know, turning it on today when it gets really hot, I decided to keep it on last night. And that's the reason why I'm probably stuffed up a little bit. Anyway, you hear Boston, he is whining in front of Savannah's door. So I just brought him in and he ran straight to her door. And I don't know if he thinks she's there now. I don't know, but he acts really weird when she's gone. So he didn't want to come in. So I left him out there because it's not, it's hot outside, but it's not like scorching hot. And he was actually laying down in the shade by the door. That way his paws aren't, you know, in the scorching cement. And there go the birds. So yeah. Anyway, let me eat my breakfast and that's about it. Nothing's going on. Okay, so I am about to get in the shower, but I'm trying to find something to wear. Um, anybody else have clothes that you bought during the shutdown and couldn't wear it? So I think I'm gonna wear something that I bought last year. Not one of the things, from, maybe one of the things that I bought from Shine, Sheen, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I have so many clothes, you guys. Remember the clothing haul that I did? The plus size clothing haul? Um, I think I've worn one of those outfits out in public. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, and I will give you guys an update on my church later. Um, yeah, pretty sad. Nobody died or anything like that. It's just, um, we've got a lot going on. Yeah, I'll give you guys an update about that later. But let me find something to wear and get in the shower. And then, did I tell you guys it's just me and Cheyenne that's going? Cheyenne is actually on her way home, and she's going to get ready, and then we are both going to go. Okay, I got to go. So I'm debating if I want to wear heels or sandals, you guys, because honestly, I have not worn heels since the shutdown, and it's super hot outside, and I don't know. I mean, I know it's a wedding, but I mean, I'm dressed nice. I don't know. Okay, I decided to wear wedges. Shine was like, um, mom, no, it's not an outside wedding. I just didn't want to wear heels. Oh, 
the reception is outside. We will not be staying long. you can see the winner of the giveaway is the Shell Bell Life. I just want to thank each and every one of you who watched that video and those who entered. Um, I chose, you know, I used a random selector thing and this is who it chose. So, I just want to thank y'all so much. Um, I will be, Michelle, I will be inboxing you on Instagram. I do follow you on Instagram, so I will be inboxing you on Instagram to get your information in a moment. Um, y'all so y'all she has a youtube channel so go over there and support subscribe to her channel she is very positive she has a really good spirit she's not into the foolishness and all that so don't take none of that over there but most of y'all over here aren't like that any either so let her know i sent you i want to thank everyone so much for supporting me i hope that each and every one of you have it has a wonderful week and i'll see y'all later bye Y'all, isn't that awesome? I won a giveaway. This is my second giveaway that I have won. I'm just finding it out this morning. It's right before I have to clock in to work. So good news before I start my work day. And this is the channel, Mo's Kitchen and Home. And I do watch her. I do support her. And go over there. And she does cooking videos, um, vlogs, life videos, whatever you think of, she does it. So I really like watching her and her family. So yeah, head over there and let her know I sent you. Good morning. It is... Monday and as you can see I am sitting at my desk just waiting to clock in but yeah you guys did you see well of course you've seen I won some knives and it's funny because I was just telling my girls that I need to get some new knives and look what happens I entered it not even thinking I was going to win but my knives are really super old and they have the wooden handle and it used to be like really dark a really dark pretty brown now it's faded brown and I'll get up and show you guys in a minute but yeah you guys I won and I'm excited can't wait to get the new knives and start using them and what else was I going to tell you guys oh as you can see I started cooking this morning instead of putting it in the crock pot I decided to put it in the oven and just slow cook it so I prepared my roast and it's only going to be me and Cheyenne that will eat it. But I prepared my roast and I have it in the oven on 200. And I will slow cook it pretty much all day. So, yeah, you guys. And I do have my coffee here. Drinking. Come on. All right. All right, you guys. I have about two minutes before I have to clock in. So, let me do that because if I... They're already sending messages. So I'm not even clocked in. I'm not even going to look at it yet. But anyway, um, let me f focus on that. Because if I keep talking to you guys, I will just um, not clock in on time. Okay, so I want to show you guys my knives. I have had this knife set since I moved into this house. And they used to be like a really dark brown. But it's faded over the years. Getting washed and stuff like that. So... I will be happy to get a new knife set and dispose of these. Oh my gosh. Look at Boston, y'all. He's so weird. Don't do it that way. Well, that way they can see this old buddy. And he's no, looking he's at such Savannah. a cutie. Is that comfortable? <laughs> Savannah Lovely. has a camera, if y'all couldn't tell by now. <laughs> Sometimes he does that and he'll kick his leg in the air. Like, he'll be asleep upside down and just running in the air i don't know you're weird old boston y'all look where we are remember when we used to be here like every other week okay so <laughs> i had to look around see if anyone was here savannah is 85 dollars. <laughs> y'all want to buy her no. selling a key hey guys i am at home 
and I am babysitting. It's just me and my little bug, but I can't show you guys her. I already told you guys, respecting their wishes. They don't want her on YouTube, so I'm not showing her face, but yeah, this is my grandbaby, you guys, and if you hear Boston whining, it's because he's unpredictable around kids and men i think i told you guys this before when we got him he would bark at little kids and i don't know maybe he was traumatized before so he's up in the crate and he's whining because he's only used to being in the crate when we're not at the house and he's like if someone's home i want to be out so i feel bad for him um i should let him in savannah's room that way and close the door but then he's just going to be closed in you guys hear those birds they are loud and she's not asleep she's awake i hope you guys can hear me i'm gonna try to not be so loud but i finally got her asleep see her little piggies right there anyway she fought so hard and but of course i won <laughs> and she was really tired um Tariq said that she didn't have her nap today or she didn't sleep as long as she normally did so she was a little cranky when they dropped her off i gave her a bottle changed her diaper and rocked her to sleep but she fought so hard but yeah i won cheyenne Tariq, savannah and annie they went to see the forever purge and yes i do want to see it but i rather be able to spend time with my little baby and I will see it eventually. So they went to see that. Then they will probably get dinner afterwards. So yeah, it's just going to be me and her for a while. And I think I was telling you guys earlier that Boston was whining because he had to be in a crate. And he's still in a crate right now. And I feel so bad because we're here. I just, you know, I don't trust him around babies right now. And, you know, when she gets older and starts walking around, um... I don't want to always have to crate him, so maybe just slowly wean him. I don't know. If you guys ever ever been in that situation where a dog doesn't like kids, do I have to forever keep him away from her, or will he get used to her the more he sees her? I don't know. I'm just not taking any chances because, of course, I love my grandbaby. I love my dog, and I don't want, you know any kind of nothing happening so yeah good morning it is saturday um it's just me in boston right now the girls actually have gone to six flags i didn't want to go i think i told you guys this before when they went a few months back i used to love going to six flags when the kids were younger but now i don't know i just and they're going to the one in Vallejo. Now, if it was the one, if we were all going to Southern California and it was Magic Mountain, I'd be up and ready to go. But I don't know, just the Vallejo Park, I don't like it anymore. So every six months, six to eight months, I have to get my blood drawn to, just to make sure everything is where it should be because we are not having that issue again. Yeah, where I passed out in my son's arms. No. Anyway, so I did that and Savannah had to get some blood work drawn as well so we made appointments like super early this morning i know i'm rambling but it's okay so you know how when you go to disneyland or somewhere and you have fast passes and you just bypass the whole line that's how i felt because at seven this morning kaiser the lab it was so full of people we walked right up because we had appointments i'd say within 10 minutes we were out and we were looking at people like yeah so anyway did that and then came back and then yeah the girls left not too long ago and it's just Boston and me that's here and he's there <laughs> he was wandering around our house a long time you know he's seen her go out the front door but yeah he was still wandering and whining but he'll be okay anyway so yeah um my grandbaby went home I did her hair last night and she looks so cute and I had such a fun time with her. She's such a sweetheart. She's such a sweet little baby. Y'all hear the birds. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just sitting here watching Why Women Kill on Paramount Plus. And check it out if you guys like that. The, I'm on the second season, but the first season has Lucy Liu in it. And oh my goodness. She's one of the main characters. Um, oh my gosh, what is her name? 
she was on Big Love and she was also on Once Upon a Time. I can't think of her name. If I remember it by the time I'm editing, I will put it across the screen. But yeah, anyway, those are two of the like the main characters in there. But if you guys have Paramount Plus and you guys like that type of stuff, Why Women Kill. At first I thought it was based on true crime stories, but it's not. It's just it's just really good. And the first season has 10 episodes and I'm on the second season now, which is a whole different set of people. So yeah, it's really good. Right up my alley. And Boston just got closer. He usually does that when, I know I'm rambling. I've been talking for what, five minutes now? I don't know. He usually does that when Savannah's not here because Savannah is his person, right? But when Savannah's not here, after he does his little wandering around the house whining and you know oh my god my life is over i don't know i don't know if that's what he's saying but that's what i'm imagining anyway so then after he realizes she's not coming in the door then he'll come by me i'm second best wow hello today is tuesday and yes i have different hair shine did my hair and I just do it up in this little messy bun, whatever. I'm not going anywhere right now. I'm actually working, and but I'm on break. Um, yeah, so she braided my hair, and I actually love it. It has the little curls on the end. So, yeah, I haven't had my hair braided in a long time. I used to get it. You guys remember, if you guys, the OGs who've been here forever, I used to always get my hair braided. But I don't often anymore because I cannot stand to sit that long. To get my hair done and as you can see she doesn't kind of big so it doesn't take very long but my head is sore because i don't get braids in my hair often so anyway did i say it was on break yeah my lips are really shiny right now because i just used my two-step lip balm that i have here what's going on nothing much just have i can't show you guys because it'll show everything but I'm watching YouTube. I have my friend Carol's video playing her latest video where she does her five below haul and dyeing her hair. And I am actually, whoops, I'm actually waiting on an order. I placed an order on walmart.com for them to deliver because I'm lazy and it's hot outside and I don't plan on going anywhere right now. So yeah, I just ordered a few things for the house. And that's about it. Nothing else is going on too much. And I am working on another video for my other channel, but it's so like disturbing that I have to put it away and I keep going back to it. I'm gonna do it, but it's just, it's very disturbing to me. So anyway, I'm still gonna do that. I know I said every Friday, but y'all know me. It'll be every Friday to every other Friday that there will be another video up there and I actually should change that on the little picture thing that's there i don't know whatever but um yeah nothing much going on i say it was on lunch i think i said it twice now anyway it's almost time to clock back in i always feel like i look different when um i do different hairstyles i don't know y'all we never have to leave the house anymore my order just got here drive off drive off it's hot my ear is on don't mind me I'm just talking to myself because I'm out here living my best life in my pajamas and I'm not going out there if they're hanging out there okay all right that was easy you never have to leave the house anymore actually ordered this last night and I'm glad I ordered it when I did because the last delivery was between two and three that was available and I was able to get that otherwise I would have to wait until tomorrow and we would have been out of trash bags anyway so yeah all right back to work